afternoon, Harpoon. I hope everybody's having a good day. My day is A-OK. -okay. Let me find the email real quick. Just bear with me one second. I'm all over the place. I know. Please forgive me. All right? Nobody's perfect, so please forgive me. All right, scheduling 20 minutes into your day to do something playful, singing along with a car radio or trying something new can help get your creative juices flowing, writes Dan Rockwell and Stan Indy Indicott. You will be more creative, more productive, and you will face uncertainty as an opportunity rather than avoiding it. Absolutely. Dude, you have to schedule out time to, to play and schedule out time to work. Now, granted, you spend more time at work than you do play. That's how you increase your pay. Five ways to draw out your team's hidden talents. Some of your po most productive and creative employees are hiding in plain sight, waiting for you to recognize their talent and nurture it, says Joel Garfinkel. In this video, Garfinkel offers five tips for leaders, including giving talented t team members new opportunities and rewarding different leadership styles to draw out more introvert employees. I like to say that I'm an introvert. I'm an introvert with extrovert tendencies. All right, like meaning that you know I enjoy talking to people when I feel comfortable. All right, being comfortable is everything. If you don't feel comfortable around people, you're not going to open up. You're not going to blossom like a flower. All right, when is good? When is a good or bad time to be? a reorganizer. Companies may want to restructure their organizational chart when new strategies make old structures obsolete. When quick growth demands new responsibilities during a merger or acquisition, however, leaders shouldn't rush into reorganization to cater to one person. And they are certain situations when process improvements or other strategies may yield better results. Organization is key to everything. All right, just organize at the right time. Sometimes you need to gather everything first and then start putting things in different places to organize it. Is your company split into silos? I don't even know what silos is, but we're gonna go over this anyway. Leaders can boost collaboration across teams and departments by holding virtual and personal meetings and providing collaboration tools and checking in with teams to access their progress, writes Jason Greenspan. Uh, senior vice president at the Grossman Group, given that leaders will forever remain critical to the company's bridge connections, uh, the best among them to continue investing the relational capital building and maintaining connections. Company split. It is what it is. You take your piece, you go to, you go home. It is what it is. Five ways to make emotional connections with an audience. Uh, make deeper connection with your audience during presentation by sharing your personal story, uh, being vulnerable and bringing your passion to the fore, writes John Meelan. Kill the jargon and relate to people in a way that shows you are real and open. All right. Be, uh, what word am I looking for? Uh, authentic. Be authentic. All right. People see through people's BS. All right. So if you're not being real, People are going to be like, nah, you know, I don't really know. He looks like a car salesman, etc. Right. How new challenges can prevent employee, employee burnout. Companies can prevent bore out, excuse me, bore out among workers in more mon monotonous jobs by introducing new challenges and opportunities for social connection to boost intrinsic motivation and interest says the Chicago Booth School of Business. You need to remember that your employees are not machines. The machine can do the same bad action over and over again and never get tired, all right? But people need to have cycling between different tasks and they do, yeah. Nobody, nobody's gonna wanna keep doing the same thing every day. You gotta change things up, all right? If you wanna retain your employees, if 
you're one of those good bosses that care about your employees, you got to change things. You got to keep things fresh. You got to keep people engaged in your company. You got to keep them wanting to return back to work instead of not wanting to be there. All right. 20900 for a trash can. San Francisco tries it out. San Francisco is trying out a new pricey public trash can prototype hoping to ward off rummaging graffiti and other problematic behaviors. The most expensive prototype. But that's too pricey for me to even deal with. That's over my head. I'm just going to keep it moving. All right. To go backward is to do nothing. All right. It is a pure loss. It means that no one has neither understood nor profited by the lessons of the past. Who said that? Gustavi Gourbet. He's a painter, a leader of the realism movement. And that's an amazing quote. Afternoon Harpoon, have a great day.